the mold. Nice little duet there. Didn't even have to update the scoreboard for it. Hope you all liked that duet. Uh, I'm sure for the however many people watching that are in chat right now, loved listening to that. Uh, so anyway, Doza taking the lead on Luca. With a nice 30 point, uh, 30 percent different. Yeah. Exactly. Like as soon as you get close to Kazia, you're fucked. Like if you can keep the range of Kazia, that, that's it. Like additionally, the giant attacks. And stuff. It is staying fairly even for now. But, oh. Luca just managing to get back on. Hey, yeah, Luca is at 100, but ooh, from 20 to out. Ridiculous how powerful Kazia can be in the right hand. I mean, I think just in general, Kazia is just really strong. Yeah. Nice killable. Oh, votes. Was does. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, no. Like, one good combo with uh, Kazia can kill you outright, can't it? And as much as we love to stand the Rosa mains, has he a better powerhouse of character? A prime example, first match, the Luca. Kazia with powerhouse attacks. We need a change of music, people. Bubblegum KK. Actually, the music. Oh, same ca characters. Play out. Imagine it. Play out. But we never know. Never know. This is what I love about this game. You never know who's actually going to win because it all depends on the players. What's going on in their head? And get some decent damage on. But also it is at 85. But bringing Luca up to 70 odd percent, that is good. That, that bring him over 100 percent. And because again, bringing Luca to 100% fell. Ooh, is that? That's Rosa out. First stop goes to Luca. But it's quite uh, high up in percentages. But just get one good spike to get him out. But Casio does have amazing recovery. I mean, especially for some uh, close quality. And that's Luca's first stock going. And he's still at. I'm getting some good early damage in on Luca. Standing a bit too close to the edge there, getting hit with up attack. He paying a favour. about Rosa in this match, she can spend a lot of time off the map where Kazuya can't really hit that well. I mean Kazuya does have his meme attacks but that's about it for range. Oh 
Oh, second stop goes to Stoza. Although Luca has just whacked him up to 107 percent A good hit can actually take on his final stock. Goes using his dodges really well there. Ooh, and there we go, evening it back out. Luca shot at a 20% disadvantage though. Yes. Very close game at the moment. It all comes down to who's got the fastest trigger, doesn't it? Really. Kazi are up to 107%. I don't have a clue. Oh, that's game. Luca just getting lucky there. Although well, not lucky. He must have known what he was doing, but Jesus Christ was that an intense match there. It's 2-0 at the moment. Both points to Luca. Stoza has been close. You lost? Edge Omega saying he lost. Absolute bullshit. You like having the game data, fam? Yeah, innit, Mosh? Going road, man, innit? Luca wearing a suit this time, taking some heavy damage, but repaying it to Stosa. That attack is... Useless against Kazia's shield. Although, if Kazia did, of course, lower the shield before the attack was finished, it could do quite a lot of damage. Us is at over 100% at the moment. Can, Luke, can Stuzza get Luca over 100%? Make it a bit more even. Got to look classy for the winning game. Or, it never know. It might not be the only one threat. Oh, Luca getting some lucky lasers on Stoz. Stoz losing his first stock while Luca's on night over a hundred percent now. If Stoza can keep up with these good shields, he can actually. Quite a huge advantage here. That grab did help quite a bit. And that's the. Nice. Uh, Luca does have an advantage at the moment, but I do believe Stoss could pull it around. I can never remember what Luma does, but which Rosa does need to be. So I need to replay Mario Galaxy. That was such a good. Stoz is evening it out steadily. There's five, there's four and a half minutes left of the match. Which there is plenty of time. There is plenty of time for Stosa to play it safe. I think that would be the way to go at the moment. Play it safe, keep a range advantage. Just chip away at the damage and eventual. Assuming with enough rain. 
danger. Doesn't get caught in with the Kazuya's trap. And we get whacked in the face. Doz is in a boss lead at the moment. Oh, Doz almost losing his second stop. Stoz is at the point where any decent hit could kill. Like that, evening it out. Advantage is still to Stoza though. It, we could see a turnaround. If Stoza keeps the range up, we could see a turnaround. Well, I thought that might have been it then. I always hate those. Cinematic attacks from Kazuya. That was a nice down beat. And is that that's the game to Stoza? Hell yes! Sorry about that guys, just getting a bit excited, but I think that's understandable. A massive lead from Lukashot and Stoza grabbing him by the balls and fucking bringing it back. Can Stoza make it 2-2? I seriously hope he can. I want this to go to a 5 round game. I, I, I am on Team Sosa right now. Because that recovery was fucking mint. It was the mintiest of mint. I don't think I've ever seen Sosa versus him. I don't think Sosa's has got that far when I've been here. The losers have a. Sorry, uh, I shouldn't be saying that on the stream. Um, excuse me. They are bottoms. 100% losers are bottoms. Wait, I'm on the losers. Fuck! I played myself. It, it, it's what happens, isn't it? We do love getting our ass beat in the losers table. Understandable. Yeah, no name's doing really good. I know we're not commentating on this current game, but honestly, I, I just want to give a shout out to freaking no name right now because it, for the first time he's playing in God knows how many years, playing well. And and Luca is quite high percentage himself, which also can repay the favor and take his back. Ooh, I think Stoz got a bit cocky then. Stoz is very high, getting high very fast. What's say I play on PC, my laptop, but them fuck all. If you want to play. Oh. It's all good. Things. Yes, we are talking about Apex on the... Oh, okay. That mine used to be bad. We're talking about Apex on a Smash stream because Apex is clearly the superior game. Well, not at the moment because rank's fucked, but I do... Ooh, Overwatch. Overwatch 2. Game 3 goes to who? Oh, Game 3 goes to fucking Luca. 